Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Andrea with Foodimentary Adventures in Food. Our channel is all about the food. We do taste tests, recipes, grocery hauls, and what's for dinner. And I am here today with a grocery haul and Christmas clearance haul from Walmart. And so I just wanted to show you guys what I picked up. Uh, now many of you know if you've been following our channel for a while, I recently had a baby. So there are some baby items in here that I needed to pick up from Walmart. So I am just going to jump in. I was so excited to go to Walmart this morning. Um, you guys know that the pregnancy was a little bit rough, so I really did not do a whole lot of shopping during the last trimester just because I was so tired and wasn't feeling well. So I was excited to hit up Walmart to see what they had today. A couple of things, like I said, we really needed for the baby. One of them is a bottle brush, which is on top. And then we also needed some um, more bottles for the baby. So I grabbed those. So we really like the Phillips, but then I saw that the Nook were on sale as well. They're like half off. So I decided to give them a try. And then we also needed some nursery water for the baby. And then I also needed some more nipples for the bottles. And I did not know that they had different nipple sizes for babies. Um, so this is First Flow, which is for newborns up to three months. So I got um, a two pack of those. So that's it for the baby. What I picked up for us were some of these beef chimichangas. Um, we really liked them. They were frozen and just pop them in the microwave. So it was really good. And then I picked up two packages of Pillsbury pie crust. They were on sale for $2.50 each. I got one for a pot pie and one for a peach cobbler that I'm planning to make. Howard was out of garlic powder where he said he was close to it. I can't remember which, but I grabbed some garlic powder for him. And then I've never seen these before. These are Skittles dips, creamy yogurt covered uh, coating, excuse me. And they had them only in this, you know, shareable size bag. I wanted a smaller package just in case I didn't like them, but I was intrigued by them, so I just had to pick them up. Another thing that I have seen advertised and wanted to try are these Kit Kat Duos. Um, Howard does not like mint, so these will be all mine, but they are mint and dark chocolate, and they just sounded really good to me, so I grabbed those. Something else that I saw that I've never seen before was this ground chicken, and it is sweet Thai style, and it has garlic, shallots, soy sauce, ginger, um, and that's it, and so you can serve it as a stir fry. What I thought I would do with it was to um, cook it up and then serve it over some rice. It sounds really good to me. Um, another thing that I grabbed, you guys know how much we like uh, sparkling juices. And so there was a, fla a couple of flavors that I'd never seen before from Martinelli's, that's my favorite. Um, so the apple mango, I've never seen, I don't think I've seen that before. Um, so I grabbed some of that. And then we have had the apple pear before, I'm sorry, apple peach before. What I've never seen is apple pear. And that sounded really good to me. Now I'm not a big fan of pear, um, as just in the raw fruit eating it. But like I said, I like sparkling juices and I like to try new flavors. So I grabbed all three of those. Another thing that I picked up is some cabbage. I plan on making some fried cabbage at some point um, in the upcoming week. And then let me get up and move around a little bit. I just grabbed some of these Doritos for Howard. He likes the flaming Hot Nachos. And then I grabbed some lightly salted Fritos. He eats them, but mostly I eat them. Now, the reason I got the Fritos is because I plan on making some chili. Now, during the last trimester of my pregnancy, I could not eat anything really tomato-based without getting horrible heartburn. I've been craving chili. So now that the baby is here, I plan on making some chili and I like making chili pies and that's where you add Fritos and cheese and stuff. So that's why I picked up the Fritos. And then the last grocery item that I picked up was this Taylor Farms grilled chicken um, chopped kit. And it has all the fixings with it. As you can see, there is the grilled chicken in there. So I thought that would be a quick meal for us. Um, for lunch or for dinner, I don't know which yet. So that um, that's it for the grocery items. Okay, so now let me show you what I picked up on Christmas clearance. So Christmas clearance stuff, if you don't know, is 50% off. Now I don't have the prices on all of this stuff, 
but do know that I got it for half off. So one of the things that I picked up are these Hershey's caramels and they um, have caramel in the center. Look really good to me. I don't think I've tried them before. Another thing that I haven't tried before are these cinnamon, um, sweet cinnamon Kit Kats. Sounded good to me too. Now, Howard and I did do a taste test on these peanut M&M um, bars and we really like them because the chocolate is really creamy and it doesn't taste like regular M&M milk chocolate. It's super creamy. These were on Christmas clearance and I remember that these were a dollar each, so I thought that was a really good deal. Next thing I picked up on clearance are these um, kitchen towels and it's a two pack. I don't remember how much they are, but the first, the one on top says, I just want to bake stuff and watch Christmas movies. I love that. And then the other one underneath is just a patterned um, towel. So I picked that up. And then I just like little things like this to put in the kitchen or the bathroom. Believe in the magic of Christmas, got that. Um, let's see here. So I also got some, sorry, I'm having to lean into the camera a little bit to get across the table, but I got some holiday spice muffin and quick bread mix that looked pretty good to me i also got the thumbprint sugar cookie kit which i love thumbprint cookies and this looked um pretty cute to me and then the last thing i picked up not the last thing sorry um the other christmas clearance food item that i picked up were these great value fruit smiles and they have all different flavors and they're 42 pouches and i do remember that these were 248 after clearance then I picked up um, gift card holders, and I love this one, Fabulous. That's so cute. I got that, and there's two in a pack, and then I got these two as well. So I really didn't go crazy buying a bunch of um, like wrapping papers and bows and all that stuff. I have tons of that stuff already, so I really didn't want to buy a whole bunch of Christmas stuff that I didn't need um, just because it was a good deal. So I think these are the only two like Christmas wrapping type items that I picked up. Next thing I picked up were these icebreaker mints on clearance and their candy cane, of course, um, was a good deal. I think these were a dollar each. And then let me try to scoot around a little bit. I picked up these gingerbread twist and shout cookies. Sounded good to me. Howard and I both like ginger, so picked that up. And another thing that I picked up, gingerbread, was the um, trail mix. Let me show you what's in here. Um, white chocolate gingerbread flavored almonds, roasted salted peanuts, and ginger snap cookies. I'll try to show you. That's what it looks like. And then I picked up this fabric garland, and it was half price, of course. Let me get a close up. And I thought I could hang that for my fireplace next year and um, it's felt, but that was pretty cute. And then the last thing that I picked up was this little rattle. It says baby's first Christmas. Um, of course, we weren't expecting our baby to come before Christmas, but um, the baby did. And so this was the only ornament that I could find, so I grabbed it. Um, it wasn't my favorite, but it has 2019. Of course, I couldn't wait till next year to get baby's first Christmas because it would say 2020 and the baby, actually the first Christmas was this year. So that's what I grabbed. That's all they had. It's a little rattle. It's not bad. Um, I just wanted something, you know, a keepsake. So this is it. Um, this is my Christmas haul and then also my grocery haul. Sorry for moving around so much and for the heavy breathing. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, we certainly hope that you'll do so. See you guys next time. Thanks for watching.